This is an RTV6 update working for you. Hello, I'm Mark Mullins, and these are your latest headlines from the RTV6 newsroom. Hiring Hoosiers is an RTV6 initiative to connect you to all kinds of career opportunities. A company specializing in the production and distribution of steel wheels plans to open a production facility in Indiana, which is expected to create more than 100 new jobs. Indiana Wheel Corp says that it will invest nearly $23 million to buy and renovate a facility in the Marshall County community of Plymouth in northern Indiana. The Indiana Wheel Corp facility is expected to lead to 117 new jobs. Helping Hoosiers stay hired, that's the goal behind a grant awarded to the Indiana Manufacturers Association. The RX Abuse Leadership Initiative, or Rally, will equip Indiana's largest industry with new resources in its response to opioid misuse and the addiction crisis. With this money, Rally Indiana and the IMA will create a digital toolkit specifically designed for manufacturers to offer guidance on how to identify and address substance misuse. And the employees who receive help will not be in danger of losing their jobs. These employers, the reality is they're going to see an unusual activity as it relates to their employees probably first, you know, whether they show up to work late or they're missing assignments. And so this toolkit will help the employers uh, identify the problem with the employees and get them to help so that they can stay employed and still be an active member of society. These toolkits are currently rolling out into Indiana manufacturing companies statewide. For more information on how Rally Indiana and the IMA is responding to the opioid epidemic, head to HiringHoosiers.com. Some comfortable temperatures in your weekend forecast. Both Saturday and Sunday will have highs right around 80 degrees, and we do have a chance for some showers and thunderstorms, but I think we're going to have a lot of dry time in there as well. True cast shows a few of those scattered showers throughout the day, and even as we go into Sunday, we'll continue with a chance for rain, but our severe weather threat overall is very low. We'll be looking at most areas picking up around a half an inch of rainfall. As we check out your seven-day planning forecast, we'll ca carry that chance of rain into Monday before drying it out a little bit and cool next week with highs in the 70s and even upper 60s by Thursday. And for more weather and stories you need to know, just download the RTV6 mobile app. I'm Mark Mullins. Thanks for joining us.